will discuss a seven segment decoder using PLA. That means we have to this is a this is a seven segment seven segment display and we know that the seven segment display these are the LEDs we named it A B C D E F G and and with these LEDs we have to display from zero to nine. And the for our first task is to that we have to find out that for displaying 0 to 9 each of the digits what are the LED should glow therefore I made a table here for displaying 0 what are the LED should glow as for example here uh, if I want to display 0 therefore except G uh, com all should display therefore a b c d e f and g is not there therefore these are the led should display x for example for displaying one and b and c should display therefore b and c should display now in that case suppose uh, displaying three a b c and a b c d and g that means a b c and d and g these two are we should not display therefore we can we made a table here the uh, according the number to display the numbers what are the LED should display this is the first task then according to that table we we use the PLA to display the required LEDs that means A B C D up to G for a required uh, which which one to we want to display now here I am explaining that that this is the, uh, the, the this is the you can say the uh, PLA and in that case the what I want to display I these are the variables I give I I give the input here suppose I give a here zero zero one zero that means two should display here. Uh, and and in that table you can if you consider that in that table uh, to display the two a b d that means a b d and a a a b d a b d and e and g that means this 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 a b d this is a this is b this is d this is e and this is g this this five uh, should display now you can you, now i am coming to the again to the pla you can see that here that this is the uh, this is the two two to be displayed the connections are it is you can see that it is high it is a will a it is connected to a one of the input to the a or gate therefore a will be the output will be high therefore b also output will be high and you can see c c is not being connected d is d is output is high e is output is high and G is output is high. Therefore, A, B, D, and and E and G will be displayed. Therefore, you can see there. You can if you compare with this, uh, you can if you compare with this, you can see very well. Therefore, it is an it is an A. This is B. This is D. This is E, and this is G. These uh, five are five inputs are connected to the connected to the OR gate and this this OR gate because of the one and any one input is high for the OR gate the output of the OR gate will be high therefore these are the and uh, this this LED will glow and remaining LED will be off and a, as a result therefore two will be displayed and the similarly exactly in the similar way it is for the other cases also therefore if we want to display one Suppose another case I'll take. If you display one, you have to you have to only B and C have to B and C have to 
display. Therefore, you can see this the, it is connected to B and one of the in, input to the this OR gate and therefore another uh, input to the this OR gate. Therefore, B and C will glow and remaining all will remain off. And in that way, we can implement uh, any whatever the variable will provide you provide here and that uh, that will be displayed and that ABC this obviously these are the ABC what we are uh, meaning here these are the uh, segment of LED uh, in the seven segment display these are the uh, each segment of LED this connections has to be made to the seven segment display and so that we can get the, uh, the required number to be displayed in the decimal form and we are giving the input to this in the binary forms and in the seven segment display the display will be in the decimal form and this is the fundamentals of displaying the numbers from 0 to 9 uh, in the seven segment display where the input is in the binaries and out and the display in the form of a decimal